Hello everyone, the fox are in here. So, we have solved our portal problem. For now, hopefully. For it. Hopefully forever. But at least for now. Um, so, what I want to do now... Gosh, I... Okay. We're gonna... Okay, I think I should have enough, um, how much hemp fibers do I have? Quite a bit now. Okay, so, because I need to make a lot of this. Hempcrete? What? Okay, sorry. I... <laughs> so, uh... A windmill sail. Huh. Okay. Anyways. I need to make a whole bunch of this. I can only make 44. Okay. And then the next thing I need to make is... So, Electrum. Because Electrum is a better cond. <sighs> Wait, no, it's not industrial. It's immersive engineering. Why did I think it was I industrial foregoing? Alright, uh, power. Wires. Basic wires. Copper wires were the most basic. generators that's right sales yeah um, breaker switch current redstone wires thermal electric logic circuits diesel lightning rod uh, accumulators oh these are the batteries power generators breaker switch Breaker switches are simply switches that have stopped the flow of power through wires. I will only allow power to pass when active. This can be used to separate power hungry machines from the network or hook up an additional set of generators when needed. Due to high risk, these switches will not accept HV wire. They will also emit a redstone signal when you switch. Uh, Additionally, they're an excellent way to control your powered lights. Hmm. Anyways. Wire. So, low voltage, mid voltage, high voltage. I'm probably... Just... I'll probably be fine with the mid voltage right mid voltage wires should be fine so what I need to do is I need electrum oh I had a whole bunch more okay so electrum that's electrum that's nickel wait where's electrum here <laughs> okay I'm going to need another hammer in fact 
I will probably need two. Or not. That was not how that was supposed to go. I did not multi-click that. Thanks very much. Okay. Going to grab wire cutters. We're going to also make more wire cutters. We're going to make two more. Okay, that didn't actually take as many as I thought it would. So now we need to mid voltage. I'll probably run out of sticks before. Nope, okay, never mind. Now I want to insulate it. only able to make 52. Alright, that's not too bad. I uh, will need to make some of these and some of these. So, let's make 16 of those. And then... That should be good. That should be good enough to get me through quite a bit now. Oh, you know what else? What what was it? What were they called? Um What were they called? What were they called? Shade, you talk so much that I lose stuff. When did we even talk about this? It's probably been a while. I don't think I'm scrolling up high enough. Actually, wait. Here, wait. If I look up this, that should be... There it is. So it's Magnum Torch, which I do not have, but I do have the Feral Flame. Oh, but this does the, this will place things outside too, won't it? Mm. Well, here, we're just going to make like 20 of these. We're going to get rid of our impromptu um, mob generators. So I should be able to just kind of, like, if I go over here and then just knock a hole into the wall, and then that should just start placing lights. Pretty much all over.
hoping that they don't place them outside of this. Because if they do, I'm going to have to... Like, yeah, they are. <sighs> I knew it. All right, well, scrap that. to think of something else. If it didn't... Where did I put that? There it is. Okay. Okay, that's all of them. Darn it. Okay, well, so that's not going to work. Because it places them outside and through walls. I forgot about that. Well, like, I wasn't sure if it did that or not. I was pretty sure it did, but I was hoping that it wouldn't. Okay, so if I go like this, is there anything? Is there a problem if I just go like that? No, no there's not. All right. How about on this side? No, no problem there either, cool. problem there. No problem there. Right, so these I guess technically these ones don't need to be insulated because they're in the wall. So I guess I should grab some non-insulated ones. Even though that's not, that's not OSHA approved. But I mean, I've already thrown OSHA out the window, I guess at this point. else by the torch thing the mega torch oh oh this is what you were talking about not oh okay okay so oops What happened to the ones that I made? What? Didn't I just... Wait, what happened? What happened just now? Did I just lose a whole bunch of them? I 
I feel like I just lost a whole bunch of them. Okay. Whatever. Alright. This should be better. also shouldn't melt. The snow outside. I don't know what their radius is. That should be enough coverage. Right? I mean, nothing is spawning. Prevents natural spawning of hostile in a big radius. What is the radius? You know what? Thirty two blocks. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that should be good enough to stop things from spawning in there. Okay, and will not melt the snow. Hopefully. do is place this right here so that should prevent anything from spawning back here place one up here that'll stop anything from spawning up here in this area down here will stop anything from spawning down here uh, need one up here to keep anything from spawning up there one right here should keep stuff spawning there one right here down here one over here for good measure and right here also for good measure one down here one over here I like how they all have pieces of string from the spiders that just kind of try and fail. Give this tree some light. Should be good enough down here. Yeah. This should stop any and all spawning from in here. Uh, I'm gonna go down here real quick. That 
should work on there. And then this one back there. Outside, okay. I'm not going to go too deep into these caves. That's actually really cool that that just pops out right there. Um, I want to put one in here just to keep things from spawning in there. And then this cave should go there. That cave's fine. should be the whole interiors lit up and good to go. And now I shouldn't have any more mobs spawning inside. Very good. So what I want is it'll come up into this room the power, I mean. Also, I'm going to do this. Which means I will need to get another rail. So that I can actually do this. So like right there or no. So the proper place. All right. I'm going to let it go dark. Um, I'm going to actually let it become night. Here will be the door for going to the nether, I guess. To come out here to go into the nether. And then put the power stuff there. Or actually. What I should do I'm gonna break from the pattern of keeping two away. Well, 
It doesn't seem like anything's spawning here, so... We need to get more blocks. <laughs> This will be where the power stuff is located. So, yeah, I need to go get more deep slate. expect that I will no longer use any of the rails uh, you are mistaken just because I have fly because it gives me a moment <laughs> to uh, take my hands off the keyboard so I will continue to do that okay, so let's just grab some deep state sleep blocks doing construction. I realize doesn't need one of these. What is this for then? Oh, a transformer. I'm probably going to need a transformer. Well, no, because a transformer is low voltage to high voltage or mid voltage, right? Transformers allow you to transition between different types of wires. Yes. Yeah, I don't think I'll need to do high voltage wires. Anyways, this is the end of the episode. Thank you for watching. Click, comment, rate, subscribe. Fox out.